in today's video i'm going to tell you what an evap is and how evap works and uh, what's the function of its solenoid and how to clean it what problem occurs if a solenoid stuck or uh, open stuck or stuck at close position okay here it is located beneath a throttle body and it has two bolts i have here 10 mm socket with a ratchet and we have to open it it has a grip it is located just here right here beneath our throttle body let me do it first Okay, here is our evap solenoid, and it takes fumes from here. Basically, the working of evap is that fumes, which are uh, fumes, are trapped in a canister, charcoal canister, and it takes the those fumes, those trapped fumes, for combustion to the intake chamber or combustion chamber, and. Uh, this is the inlet and this is the outlet to the combustion chamber or the throttle body now the working is when it gets activated in in my case it's a 2006 mitsubishi lancer jdm version and uh, in it what happens is that it closes when in in the in the off position and uh, when we turn on the key or turn on the ignition the valve opens so that the trapped fumes in the canister uh, get burnt and we get good mileage now we have to test two things and uh, we have to test either we have current at our connector and uh, the second thing is it works on 12 volts so we have to connect two wires with the battery and test it by tapping the pins with the wires and we should hear a click sound if it if it works it should it should do a click sound So you shouldn't you shouldn't try this at home because we don't have anything like uh nipples or something but we should hear a click sound as you can hear it's working but some of the time what happens that the solenoid works but it doesn't closes or opens uh fully so we have to clean it and it should be working fine so here is our connector for the evap and we should see that if, if it's working or not if it's getting a signal or not current is there or not and current is there it means the wiring is fine it's working correct and next what we have to do is we have to put back our evap solenoid and it should work as intended if your valve is stuck or open uh, stuck open or stuck close uh, what you can do is you can get a card cleaner and uh, you can spray it in both of these holes so that any dirt or debris can get out and uh, if there is carbon or something like that uh, the valves should be clear so uh, we have to clean it with a card cleaner and it's it should be working fine and please bear in mind that it should have a click sound clicking sound if it's not there it means your solenoid is not working